Hey everyone! So as part of the first ever Maybelline Philippine squad, Maybelline challenged me to recreate a look that was spotted on the runways of New York Fashion Week. One trend that stood out for me was the Back to Brown's makeup look because it's something that you can wear for an everyday sort of look. If you guys notice, all of my makeup looks are more on the fresh, natural side using pink tones. So I felt like doing this look would be fun. I don't normally wear brown lipstick, so that's another reason why I wanted to do this look. Maybelline sent over a few products for me to use. Uh, incidentally, they also happen to be staples in my makeup kit already. These are going to be three products that I'm going to use in this makeup tutorial. So it's the V-Face Duo Stick. The Lash Sensational Mascara and Creamy Matte Lipstick and Nude New Ones. Keep watching to know how I was able to achieve this look. So the first product I'm going to be using is the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Liquid Foundation. This is in the shade 220. This has been one of my staple foundations because it's really lightweight and it blends seamlessly on my skin. It actually feels like second skin. You guys can check the review on Calixta.com. I actually reviewed this product. You kind of just dab it all over your face. Take a beauty blender or a sponge. Um, make sure it's damp and then just dab it and blend it seamlessly. I did my eyebrows for this. I did my eyebrows this morning, that's why I didn't do it anymore now. The product I'm gonna use is the Maybelline V Face Duo Stick. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you'll know that I use this product all the time in all of my makeup looks. I love using this to contour and it's really easy to use, plus the shade is not too warm so it fits my skin tone well. Going for a really strong brown kind of look. Um, I'm gonna make my contour a little bit stronger in this look too. Take your blender again, use the other side to just dab it and make sure the harsh lines aren't seen. Done with the liquid foundation and the cream contour stick, you want to set everything with powder. And for this look, I'm going to be setting it with the Maybelline Fit Me Matte and Poreless Powder. This is in the shade 220 as well to fit the just to complement the liquid foundation. Set your your foundation and your concealer. I'm just going to amplify the look of my contour using the V-Face Blush Contour. So this is another staple in my makeup kit. I love using this. I love actually like the shade of the blush. It's just it's perfect for all the looks that I like to do. And also the, the shade of the contour. It's not too warm as well so it fits my skin tone perfectly. Normally I just use the brush that comes with it since it's already angled. Up next, now that we're done with the base, I'm gonna be moving on to my lashes. And for my lashes, I'm gonna be using Maybelline Slash Sensational Mascara. And if you guys notice, I've also been using this a lot. I've been obsessing over it lately. Like it's, I have one in my office drawer, I have one in my makeup cream case, I even have one in my bag. If you want to create that Back to Brown's New York Fashion Week look, I'm going to be using the Maybelline Creamy Matte in Nude Nuance. This is a really nice wearable brown shade. And that's basically it. So it's a really easy look that you can do and that you can even wear it for every day. 
Thanks for watching and I hope you guys enjoyed learning more about this New York Fashion Week look. Don't forget to follow Maybelline Philippines on Facebook and Instagram. I hope you guys can also visit GretasJunkyard.com and follow me on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram at Gretas Junkyard on Facebook and at Gretchen Gatan on Twitter and Instagram. So that's all for now. Thanks guys. Bye!